Hey guys, Wet Movie One back here again, and it's time to go ho 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 up. Are you guys ready? I know I am right now. Uh, one of the big releases uh, that's coming out today is Eternals uh, from Disney and Marvel and stuff like that. Um, that's coming out on 4K, Blu-ray, and everything. I think there may be some retail exclusives. Not gonna lie, not really interested uh, in that one. I know a lot of people going out there today is that's their like their main get. The main thing they want to get up on today, and that's cool. But for some reason, I have really no no urge to get it. But uh, Looper uh, is being released for the first time on 4K. The one that stars Joseph Gordon-Levitt and everything. That's kind of cool. The Howling is being released today on 4K from Scream Factory. But there's two. There's other. There's some other stuff too. Like I believe Hey Arnold is coming out on Blu-ray. The Hey Arnold the movie. But uh, the two main things that come out today that I I, I know I'm going to get for sure. Is uh, but I, I'm, not, I'm not gonna see them in stores. Is uh, Nick of Time, which is one of my favorite Johnny Depp movies of all time, being released on 4K. Johnny Depp and Christopher Walken, great thriller movies coming out today uh, on Blu ray. Uh, I believe MovieZing.com uh, is releasing that one as well. Uh, link for that, uh, their website is down below at the very bottom of this, my description box. And they're also releasing 200 cigarettes. Uh, on Blu-ray. I've always liked that movie because of Christina Ricci, Gabby Hoffman, and just the cast in general uh, of that movie is, is being released today uh, on uh, Blu-ray. So Nick of Time, 200 Cigarettes are like the main two mo movies I want to get up on, but I don't think those are the ones that I'm going to see in stores, at least nowadays. You know, the catalog titles. But uh, if you guys support my videos, hit that thumbs up button. Let's head on out to the stores today, maybe some thrift stores as well, and see what we come across. It is kind of cold. And uh, ra rainy out <laughs> right now, but I just arrived to my first destination of the day, the American Way Thrift Store. Let's head on in. Well, guys, I just made it in here, and uh, this is the place that you know has the stuff behind glass uh, for the most part when it comes to their DVDs and things. They do have the 15th anniversary tin can uh, set of the Reservoir Dogs uh, right there, which is kind of cool. Uh, we also have Philly Brown. Is, uh, is kind of a cool movie with um, uh, Gina Rodriguez and stuff, but other than that, I don't think I'm gonna get up on any of the DVDs today, but I had to come in and check. But they sure as hell didn't have a whole lot of DVDs to pick from, but now I'm walking towards the, the you know, VHS area over here, and it looks like it's kind of slim pickings, uh, even when it comes to VHS tapes. I'm always hoping to come across like some horror ones, like some old school, like horror stuff. But uh, you never know unless you look uh, over here. But let's see if I can find something kind of cool, or maybe even like a, some cool sealed ones or something like that. That kind of tricked me. That one kind of tricked me. I thought it was sealed for a second, but it has an old blockbuster uh, sticker on there, which is kind of cool. Uh, you know, from previous viewed sticker. They do have uh, Never Too Big, that's what she said, uh, on VHS right there, but, eh, what is it, oh, they have this, I don't know if you guys remember these, these came out in the later years of uh, VHS tapes, like when they were about to, you know, go out, they like widescreen and like, um, like special edition like VHS tapes that come in like little mini clamshells, I don't know if you guys remember those, uh, they were, they were kind of cool, I mean, I believe I had one like this. Uh, of like Dawn of the Dead uh, that came out back then, but uh, that's kind of that's kind of cool to see. Broken Arrow is kind of cool too. That movie's not talked about enough, but that that's a pretty uh, decent uh, Travolta flick right there. But let's get on out of here. Not finding nothing today over here. Before I head on over to like Walmart and stuff, let's head on over to this other thrift store called New to You and see if they have anything cool. Yeah, yeah just got in here and uh, back here is where they usually keep like the DVDs and. Like VHS tapes and stuff, they keep they move them around every once in a while, but uh, they do have some 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 stuff here. Um, Twenty bucks though for <laughs> the Terminator uh, Blu-ray set right there, but sometimes you can find some decent uh, decent deals in here. And if I do find anything, I'll definitely show you guys at the end of the end of this adventure right here. But let's get digging. Still looking around in here. They only have real select Blu-rays like that Harry Potter set that you saw for like 30 bucks. Cesar Chavez, Harry Potter, Deathly Hollows, you know, 3D Blu-ray in here. 
you know, other like, you know, real common, uh, you know, DVD titles. Now I'm diving into like the VHS stuff, seeing what they got going on in here. Um, of course, the obligatory, you know, Titanic VHS, you know, multiple copies of them uh, in here. Like when you go to thrift stores, as you guys already know, uh, that and Jerry Maguire are the, the top two most produced uh, VHS tapes of all time. And the movie, the 50 cents, I guess, or price is marked uh, when it comes to them. Upstairs, downstairs on VHS. There's some stuff in here. Nothing too crazy, though. Ooh, as good as it gets. Is it factory sealed? It is factory sealed. But it's also not one of those ones that's worth anything. Like eight bucks. But, you know, you never know. I always check, just in case. But, uh, you know, didn't, didn't not really come across anything uh, in the thrift store today, so. Over at my next stop of the day, Walmart. Man, it's getting cold out right now. There's even snow by the front door of Walmart on the floor. But let's get on in here and see if we find anything. Just made it into Walmart, guys, looking at the new release rack, seeing what they got going on today. Everything looks pretty much the same from previous weeks, except uh, for Eternals that they have on a, a DVD right here, Blu-ray, digital copy, and of course their exclusive edition, which they have one left it looks like. No, wait, they have like a big display over there. They still have a, they have a big display uh, that they got going on over here. It's like they're getting new ones every week now of like the displays for like the different movies and stuff, so that's kind of rad. But this one comes with an enamel pin, kind of like how Encanto did you know, it came with an, an, an enamel pin. But for some reason, not really interested in seeing this movie. Like, we have Disney Plus and everything like that in, in the house, but I'm still not even really interested in watching it that way. I'm not saying it's going to be a bad movie, but I'm just not, not the biggest, you know, superhero guy, uh, you know, that of all the recent stuff that's out there right now. I'm excited to see the Batman movie and everything. What is this? The Handler uh, with uh, Chris Levine. This one's uh, came, coming out today from Uncorked Entertainment, it looks like. And uh, the 20, 27 hour day, a new Hallmark movie uh, that looks like it's being released today. But let's check the new, the other little section here, see what they got going on, if anything new at all. Uh, they do have Heels, the complete first season uh, on DVD for $24.96. I'm not sure if this was this week or not, but I don't know, what is this? Day 1, 2022? What a wrestling... What is this? What is this like a new event that I didn't even know about? Like a pay-per-view I, I missed or didn't know about? Because I thought, I thought WWE or WWF, whatever you want to call it, was done releasing physical media. Because this is new. I've never seen this one out in the stores before. This has to be new. I don't know what to think about that, but we got, of course, you know, Brock Lesnar uh, on the cover right there. Hmm. And Doctor Who, Flux, the complete 13th season. I don't think I've seen that in the stores either, so that one most likely is new, along with this uh, Tom and Jerry, uh, Cowboy Up, the movie, uh, on DVD right there. And uh, that's all I'm really noticing that's standing out to me right now over here at Walmart. And um, do I need this in my life? I don't know. Ba -da -ba -ba -ba. It's Best Buy. Let's head on in. See what they got going on today. Just got in here, and uh, it looks like they do have the Howling uh, 4K Blu-ray set from Scream Factory right here. Uh, not gonna lie, never been one of my favorites or anything like that, or any of the Howling movies have never been uh, any of my favorites. But Joe, Joe Dante, the director of this, and of course the same director of The Burbs uh, with uh, Tom Hanks, classic director, really cool guy. I met him a couple times in the past. They do have Looper uh, as well on 4K being released for the first time today. I would have thought Sony would have released it with a slipcover, but I guess, you know, I was uh, sadly mistaken uh, over here. That's $22.99 and uh, $27.99 for the Howling. That's kind of cool that they have it. That's kind of cool that they got those. And of course, the other new release that they have is the new release rack over here is Eternals on a DVD, Blu-ray, and a 4K right here. They do have a Best Buy exclusive steel, steel book today, but they're kind of like really up towards the front, and I'm not trying to mess around with those right now, but they have like an exclusive Best Buy steel book. Uh, they have a whole bunch of them, but up front for some reason, 34 dollars 
But uh, let me know down below. Is it worth watching? Did you guys like it? Let me know in the comments. Getting out of Best Buy right now. Not jumping on anything today. It is what it is. Like, you know, I wish I liked the Howling movies more. But I, I'm not gonna lie, I can't front. I really never did. But um, it is cool to see Looper being released on 4K. That movie is all right. But uh, right now, we're gonna be heading on home. And uh, to open up two packages, they came in the mail right before I left the house. So let's head on back. Well, I'm back home now from doing my hoarding adventure. Like I said, didn't find anything out there in a while today. But yesterday, I went to my closest Goodwill that's you know, near, near by where I live. And I came across a copy of Slam Dunk Ernest uh, on DVD in there. Factory sealed. And uh, this, this one sell for around $20 to $25 uh, on eBay. So I put it up on my eBay store and stuff like that. So if anyone's interested, link to my eBay store is in the description box of my videos. But, um, like I said, I didn't get that in this video. I, I bought it yesterday. But uh, I can't, you know, I have uh, two packages that came uh, to my house today from different uh, studios or PR companies that send me stuff to talk about for videos. And I think these are both coming from Rancho Cucamonga. I could be wrong, but uh, let's open this up. One of them might be Warner Brothers, the other one I'm not sure exactly. But let's find out what, what came today. These ones actually showed up today, Tuesday, and see what, what, what's in here. House of Gucci. This is House of Gucci on Blu-ray. I believe this one's uh, being released on um, the 22nd. Yeah, being released on Blu-ray and DVD February 22nd in stores everywhere. But in the last video that I made that I put up, um, I got a copy of this. So I got to message someone to see what's going on about that. Because I already, I already have one already. You know, that I actually, op you know, watched and everything like that. But uh, I have to, I'll probably have to contact uh, my, my, the people over at Universal and stuff. So, uh, I also have this package. This is coming from FedEx uh, right here. But like I said, House of Gucci, I'll be talking about that in a future uh, DVD update video or Blu-ray update, whatever video. Most likely this week, sometime this week, I'm guessing. Because uh, I try to have at least 10 to 15, you know, 10 to 15 movies I've watched and talk about them all in one video. But let's find out what uh, this package is uh, right here. What's in this one? Oh! This is, for, yeah, this is from Warner Brothers. And this is The Green Mile. Uh, this is being released for the very first time uh, on 4K right here. Of course, starring Tom Hanks and um, a, lot of, a lot of great people in here. Michael Clark Duncan. Uh, who also used to uh, go to the Blockbuster, not the one I used to work at, but the one that was kind of like a, a couple miles away, like the, the closest Blockbuster store to the one I used to work at. He, Mark, Michael Clark Duncan uh, used to be one of the customers at that location, uh, from what you know, different co-workers told me, and everything like that. And this is this is a great movie, man. Really sad, but really a really a great flick right here. The Green Mile uh, for the first time on 4K. Let's see what the paperwork says uh, when it says to, when, it, when it's being released and everything. It's going to be, you can own it on the 22nd, yes, uh, February 22nd, uh, 2022 on 4K for the very first time. Uh, yeah, that's what it says right here on the Warner Brothers paperwork. But uh, thank you Warner Brothers for sending that on over. I can't wait to check this one out and see what kind of, if there's like new special features on this or pretty much if it's like some of the same ones, I'm not sure, but I'll find out. But uh, that's all I have to show and talk to you guys about today for this little hoarding adventure. It's really cold, rainy out, and it's like snow on the mountains out here where I live. So we're going to be having to turn the heater on tonight. <laughs> but thanks guys for watching. Catch you on the next one. Hit that thumbs up if you guys support the videos.